Hi there lovely people, good morning from Dhaka Bangladesh, hopefully you're all doing good. Today I'll be reviewing a fragrance. I don't think there are so many reviews of it just yet because it's sort of like a very new uh, recent release. I don't know when it was released exactly but yesterday I went to um, like Oud community uh, convention sort of like they had a nice sort of fair going on and I was invited there uh, by one of our brothers there, Mr. Rafezami. Thank you so much brother if you're watching this. Um, I went there just to experience because I'm not an Oud guy per se because some people as not everything is for everybody. Oud is just like oil others, they are just overpowering for me. And I'm not saying that with disrespect, just that I'm not into that game yet, okay? So many people love Oud. So I just want to see experience. And then it was a huge uh, uh, program. So I went to a stall and I'll leave a link below. It's called MMC Luxury Perfumes. So they launched recently in Bangladesh and they are authorized dealer for Ajmal, Afnan, few other brands. And you can get them at very good prices. You can go even tomorrow. They have a like... Tomorrow means like today, you know, whole day from 9 a.m. to 9 p.m. It's Friday and Saturday, two days in Shamoli Ring Roads, I think in the White House, White, White Hall Convention Center level two. So I bought some perfumes and I am going to have a lot of Afnan and Ajmal perfumes review coming up because I'm buying left and right, you know, the ones I wanted to review. So today, sorry for the long intro, I'm going to talk about this one right here. You guys know Afnan 9 a.m. and 9 p.m. So this is 9 p.m. Dive. There's one for women uh, from 9 p.m. or a.m. line. I haven't reviewed that. Perhaps I will in time. So this one, it has much better packaging than the 9 p.m. It's much upgraded. Uh, packaging wise, I'll show you and I'll talk about it. It's EDP concentration 100 ml and I think it's a 2022 release. OK, safe to say. So beautiful blue packaging, Afnan. <clears throat> and Afnan's a little bit more pricey than Latafas, if you ask me. Middle Eastern housewives, you know, I have reviewed many Afnans. So Afnans I paid around always 10 20 dollars more than lot of us okay so this is a little bit on the higher side so overall this is going to be under 40 dollars uh, price tag more or less when i open this you see packaging packaging game okay i'm i'm going to be very careful i'm sorry the bottle may drop this is how the packaging looks inside okay just i'm going to take some time because i'm a i'm a packaging and then bottle and all those things uh, guy this is what the background looks like and this is like ocean and this bottle goes, man, I put lotion <laughs> in my hand, it's slippery. Oh man, the struggle is real. Yes, success, sorry. My, because after shower in the late night, 5 a.m., I took shower weird, but I apply lotion and stuff. So hand is a bit, hey, don't get naughty thoughts. Sorry about that. So this is how the bottle looks. Just take a look inside. It's a beauty. It's a beauty. I give 10 for Afnan's packaging, solid packaging. And uh, it's a niche style packaging. I love it. Okay, 10 for packaging. Bottle follows 9 p.m., 9 a.m., same bottle. Very nice, uh, I would say. The cap is metal, like a crystal ball kind. And the juice color, I'm not sure if the juice is blue, but the bottle is definitely light blue. Here, the front says the name. It's EDP concentration back. Looks like this. Very nice packaging, smooth. Nowhere, there's a rough edge. There's a sticker. Um, I sprayed this. I saw it. I got so excited, man. The ones I'm going to review next few days, trust me, I'm so excited about them. And they're going to be some major fragrances. Very heavy. Okay, don't dro drop that on your foot. It'll be a mistake. Let's see the sprayer. Very nice sprayer. So Afnan's 9 p.m. was a huge hit. Thanks to my aw awesome review. And uh, I am the one who's responsible for the success. Joking. Not. <laughs> and that's not my credit only. Every single reviewer who reviewed it. Basically, I uh, really liked it. That was a clone of Ultra Male on Beast Mode and on budget. Okay, definitely one third of Ultra Male's budget. So that was a hit. And definitely, uh, I understand that um, in India, our subcontinent countries, that was a top seller. So how is this one? Is this going to be the next big thing? Um, you see, I'm in a little bit different kind of mood because I'm excited. I'm happy because it's a brand new release and it definitely has to be good, right? So this is on the fresher side. When I sprayed this, I sprayed literally like hundreds of perfumes yesterday. I smell oud, uh, smelling incense everywhere. It was heavy. My nose got so tired and I still smell this in the middle of all this oud. Guess that and I loved it. Immediately took it. Uh, the page you can buy it from is MMC Luxury Perfumes. They are based in Chittagong in port city of Bangladesh. But they have a page. I'll leave a link below. You can order from them. So very nice owner, beautiful, beautiful gesture. He gave me a lot of samples and gave me discounts. You can go today. If you see this video, you might get some uh, like good offers on it. So enough talk. How's this one? Fantastic. Uh, is this a clone of anything? First of all, you're waiting. Is this a clone of something? To my nose, no. 
I never, I don't think I have exactly something like this. It's just like a fresh burst of uh, new life. And that's what I was waiting for. If you're asking me, is the Bleu de Chanel Sauvage clone? It's in that family. But this is citrus. It's lemon. And the thing is, it's very uplifting. I think it has a grapefruit. I don't know the nose breakdown, but it's fruity, citrus, lemon. All the good citruses are in this. And it's watery. It's porty. You saw the packaging. It definitely portrays this color. Okay. If you know this color, this is what this fragrance smells like. Light blue with a hint of darkness. And uh, darkness means not very dark. Not like black dark. <clears throat> but this one has good body to it it does not project and last more than the 9 pm mind you if you're looking for oh is this better than that two different fragrances two different worlds 9 pm i don't know where i kept my bottle it was almost finished but that one lasted well over eight to ten hours since this is a freshie you will get on your clothes five to six hours plus okay and that is plenty good because afnan is not joking you know like they're making good quality juice but then again it varies okay i just wore it once and i'm telling you from my experience Maybe in the high heat, it will project and last more. Maybe it will last less. Uh, you have to test it. Just get a test run, spray it on your skin and see. But don't expect beast mode from it. Like it's going to project five hours. I don't think it will. On my skin, it just sits nicely. It's a very nice aromatic dry down. It, maybe there is a, a note like clary sage or something. Very sharp. Juniper berries perhaps. It feels like gin and tonic sometimes. So it's like a very refreshing. Sometimes you smell some from Pen Halligans, you know, like uh, one fragrance was something gin and tonic. I forgot the name. Um, it was a name of a drink. Ah, oh, man, what was the fragrance? It reminds me sort of like that. Some Tom Ford uh, blue lines. But overall, it's a soapy on the dry down, fresh right out of the shower and has that beautiful opening of lemon burst. I just love it. Uh, just let me spray once more. Which goes away very very quickly the lemon i wish stayed longer but to my nose this one it's a very interesting opening they just capture you with that opening so if you like let's something like versace menu phrase somewhere there versace purum dior sauvage bleu de chanel it has picked up some elements for everything but it's not a clone of anything so that's credit of this perfume if it's a clone of something do let others know maybe i don't have that perfume maybe if they're trying to capture uh, like coach for men i also don't know i have that but it doesn't smell like it if it's a clone of some niche perfume, I never tried, but it's a quality. The juice, if you keep your expectations realistic, you might say uh, this is a good purchase. But some of you will be like, it did not last. It did not project one spray. That's what you conclude. It's up to you. But I would suggest try it and then try at least a few times before you make up your mind because it's not really uh, $20 cheap. It's like $35, uh, I think $38 more like in Bangladesh, under $40. So it's a good budget fragrance but maybe other sellers will bring it in future you know if you can get it from uh, other sources cheaper you can but i don't think it will be cheaper than 35 bucks so uh, invest wisely try first definitely um, summertime you can use this easily going out uh, office gym work very versatile anywhere you wear this nobody's gonna complain uh, people who are around you they can smell you in the office place it will really really be beautiful it will not offend anybody i think and uh, for the dating purpose, ladies love freshies. Trust me, you may be thinking, should I wear something like a oud or something very heavy incense? She's not going to even talk to you. She's going to stay far from you. Ladies love, I'll tell you with all due respect, fresh perfumes. Something in the sweet category, something like stronger with you leather, the sweet side or some citrusy. Ladies love citrus. Okay, so this is going to be a pleasant fragrance for everybody. Ideal gift item. Uh, the performance if this was uh, i don't know maybe i'll test it in the high heat in sun just wearing this because i was wearing something else the whole day i will update you on the performance but so far i'll give performance solid eight not ten so this fragrance is gonna get a solid 8.5 out of 10 uh, from me very beautiful fragrance very very uh, reachable very lovable and i think i like it if the performance gets better i'll give it a nine if performance doesn't get better i'll give it 8.5 good value for money so Afnan, brand new fragrance, very excited, finally covered it. Check it out. I'll do a full-on review in maybe a couple of weeks' time. Thank you so much for watching. Next time. Next one, it's going to be a female perfume. Let's see how that one goes. Take care.